Hello ladies, this is Patricia here, also known as God's Design One here on YouTube, and thanks for tuning in to my channel. This video is going to be um, a trial slash tutorial. I've never done it before, that's why I'm skeptical to call it a tutorial, because I feel like if you don't know how to do it, how can you teach other people how to do it? But basically it's the same concept um, as my last tutorial, which, sorry, it's my Twitter going. Um, same concept as my last tutorial, which was the two strand flat twist out on blown out hair. And basically this is going to be my first braid out on blown out hair. So I haven't tried it, but I'm looking forward to doing, um, the, doing it. So if it turns out all right, I'll call it a tutorial. If it is a fail, I mean, if it's an epic fail, I'll call it a trial. Okay. And so I'm starting out with blown out hair. I did it on the medium set this time and um, I use my Shea Cream um, as my only heat protectant this time. I didn't use the Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioning Repair Cream only because I'm testing out a new regimen and I don't want to mix any other conditioner with what I'm doing right now and hopefully I'll get to talk about that in another video to come. So enough talking, let's get started. Um, I already parted my hair down the side because that's how I want my hair to lay. Um, I don't have anything guys. I'm so unprepared. Okay, yeah. So let me just kind of make sure this is straight. Alright, I'm going to start it off like that and then I'm going to finger comb this out right here. Let me make that just a bit smaller. Um, I'm not too sure what size to do it in. Because like I said, I haven't done this before. But one thing I do know that I don't want to do is I don't want to cornrow it because I feel like that'd be hard. it's going to be harder to camouflage the parts that way. So I'm going to use <clears throat> my Shea Cream. I'm going to use about this much in, that, in this section. Starting off with the ends and working my way up. And then I'm going to use our aloe vera gel as my holding agent. The same, same um, things that I used in that last video. Same products. It took about that much. And then I'm going to braid. Um, I'm going to braid it toward the side because I don't think I want it to come toward my face. So I'm going to smooth it out a bit and then start braiding. I hope that y'all at least know how to braid. At least. Because <laughs> I, I don't think I can break it down like that. But I'm going to start braiding and I'm kind of putting a good amount of tension. Not on my root but on the actual braid. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to get about here and just to ensure that I get a curly type end I'm going to take a little bit of more aloe vera gel and then set and put the three sections into two and then start twisting and then start twisting this is the same way I do my braid outs on my on my wet hair so I'm going to just continue just to do that on the dry hair as well because I kind of don't want that crinkly, crinkly look. You know how braid outs can get. I don't want it to be crinkly. And then kind of twirl the ends in my hand like that. So that's what it looks like. Alright, I'm going to finish it up and then I will be back. Hey ladies, I am back and um, I'm done braiding everything. Okay. And um, I'm excited to see how this thing turns out. I really am. I hope it turns out good. I really do because I'm not in the salvaging a hairstyle type of mood. I mean, whatever it does is how I'm going to rock it. So we just pray that it turns out cute. Um, it didn't take me too long to do. It just has 10, 10 braids in it. I'll show you the back. So I'm getting sleepy now. Um, it's it's early. It's early. It's about a quarter to 11 where I am. And I have to get up at 4.30 to do my morning jog. And then my devotion. 
and then I have to be out of the house by 6 so you'll see me tomorrow maybe around 530 taking this hair down <laughs> um, I'll be out of here by 6 to head to the hospital so tomorrow's going to be a long day eight hours at the hospital then I gotta come back on campus no I gotta go get my oil change and then come back on campus I have a meeting tomorrow's gonna be a long day but my hair's gotta hold up basically is what I'm trying to say so um, even for workouts so my hair might trip you know during my jog I really hope it doesn't but either way you guys will see all the results tomorrow morning all right night guys good morning ladies um i just wanted to come in really quickly and show you guys what it looked like i'm extremely extremely late um so i just wanted to tell you guys things that i would have changed i would have made i would have made the braid sizes a little bit more uniform um the ones in the front right here are a lot more crinkly than the ones like say right here i tried to open this up as best as i could and I just put a little vitamin E oil in my hands and then I just open them up. Last time you guys asked for a 360, so I'm gonna turn around. So that's basically what it looks like. Um, I'm excited. I'm gonna try it again tonight um, and hopefully I get better results. So give it a try, guys. Braid out on low dried hair it's like a really really stretch like my hair seems or looks really, really long it is long but it's there's like hardly any shrinkage so i like that you can really see the true length of my hair so this is what it looks like just fluffed up a bit and separated and yeah i like it i'm gonna try it again definitely so i hope this helps someone thanks for watching i'll see you next time with another video and as always god bless